Welcome back everyone to Let's Play Dragon Age Inquisition. So here we are. Um, our thingamabobs are actually ready so I'm thinking... Uh, oh, I need to stop doing that. Um, so I think I might actually go back to Haven and... That's not what I want to do if I go on to... That's what I want to do if I want to go back to Haven. There we go. Um, so I'm gonna go do that, possibly send my my people out again, and yeah, just see what else we did, considering we accidentally sent Colin away on some silly mission that we didn't want to send him on, but okay. <laughs> I was gonna send um, Josephine, but nope, not allowed, apparently. Because I misclicked. There we go. And it still sort of freezes in that exact spot. Okay, no matter. As long as it keeps on going either way. <clears throat> you dislike the Templar, sister? No. I know their purpose, but you remember I once ministered in a circle chantry. Yes, I assumed you were used to having Templars around, keeping us safe from the mages. The mages in the circle follow the chant of light as faithfully as the Templars, sister. More faithfully than some Templars, even. Some of the things those Templars did when they thought I did not see. Well, there's always going to be rotten eggs. Just kind of sad. Um... Right, I need a crystal grace, whatever that is. I'm not entirely sure what that is. Um, Thanks for checking anyway. I figured there was something new because it glowed when I got there, but nothing new. So, do -do 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 -do. these truths the maker has revealed to me. I will take the one Here we go. Let's see what you've been up to and how things have been going. How did this go? Uh, Commander Cullen, I'm I to understand you are in charge of the soldier trampling on my lawns, providing food and refuge to the scrabble of filth burrowing into my land. A plague on you, sir, for spitting in the face of an honest petitioner, for taking advantage of my distress. Did you, my wretched neighbour ban traft this whisper in your ear? Tell me what he paid you so that I may at least know the price of treachery, sir. My only consolation is that I've that a few of the rank and file have gone to join your farce in, in of an inquisition. In bitter disgust, Lord Kildarn. Well, yeah, that could have gone better. <laughs> How did it go, to Liliana? Uh, my dear Liliana, your author friend is truly a mystery. Our search uncovered only a string of foreign accounts. The trail of coin led from Antiva to Tevinta to the Free Marches and Olay. Someone hid the tracks well, but not well enough. Your writer is in Kirkwall. And remember, you owe me a favour. Well, what do you know? Um... So, let's see... Available, completed, completed. Uh, we explore the fallow mire after you clear the place out. I've stumbled on an old road that leads west to the frostbacks. If it's cleaned up, you could use it to shave off weeks of a journey through the mountains. I'd rather be wet than freezing. Uh, yeah. I can see that, Harding. I know what you mean. It would rather just handsomely for the road. Perfect for a spice, we remain secret. Could move troops east to west without risking the mountains. That gives the road for soldier, they can repair it. Um.
Let's keep it open for everyone. Go, Josephine. Let Do us you begin. think? Um, up until now, the Inquisition forces have had the benefit of the Chandra's deep coffers. Now the Inquisition is forced to seek out its own sources of revenue if it is going to grow further. Trade in and out of Haven is limited at this point, but there are various opportunities to earn coin, provided the Inquisition is willing to focus its efforts on the matter. Um, should have a Josephine on that as well. Um, yeah. Liliana, Let's see what we have. do help my old acquaintances, will you? That would be nice. Secrets of Contrast. Um, yeah, we should have someone look at those up at some point. Um, yeah, I don't want to go there yet because I want to do things. Is there anything... Oh, report. The Chantry remains. Diplomacy won the day. The clerics chosen to receive aid have been the most appreciative and have successfully drowned out our detractors. This caused an internal struggle. Clerics hiring thugs to kill other clerics. I was forced to intervene. Such despicable behavior from those who aspire to this sunburst throne. The mood in the Grand Cathedral is tense, but for now the Chantry can be counted on. Our political ally. Yes. Thank you, Josephine. Um, I should probably send Josephine on that. Um, there's not much I can send Colin on at the moment. Let's just keep keep it like that for now and go back to There we go. That was the key I was looking for the other time I was set playing because I was looking around for it. Um that's not necessarily what I wanted to do. Um, I'm not gonna go to the Storm Coast just yet. Nope. No. What that? I want to go to the hinterlands. I want to check in with. See if I can find this black wall. And speak to Dennis. Like possibly get horses, that would be nice. Was there a way up there or do I need to go up here? I'm not entirely sure. Well, this looks like the right way up at least. Uh, or maybe not, I don't know. There we go. I was gonna say everyone else can go up, but me. That would be silly. Um. Oh cool, we need one of those. And elf, elf root. There. 
speaking is hard, okay? Right behind us. I think I need more Embryum for something as well. I think it was one of the upgrades that needed more of that. What did my minimum want? It said I had something to do over here. Oh, it's pointing to that one. I'm not sure who I want to side with, though, if I want to side with um, the mages or the Templars. Um... I am tempted to say the mages, though, because we do need, apparently need more power to possibly seal the um, breach. But we don't know what kind of power we need. So that's a thing. Oh, stop going up, popping up behind me. That's just rude. Oh, perfect. Always use more of those, though. I guess the storm coast should be where we head after we're done with this. It's up here. Oh, there's something up here as well. Yeah. I remember. We didn't want to go there because they were kind of powerful. While we were not, so we were better equipped this time, so hopefully we can go there. Hopefully, possibly. But first let's see if we can find this uh, black wall dude. Grey Warden. That'll be interesting. They will make us a fight, not us. Oh, there you are. You weren't so very hard to find, it, after all. No oh. <laughs> Silly dwarf. Stop falling down. There we go. I'm just gonna sneak into your house first. The Orlesian Empire. There are many lords and ladies in Val Royal. I mean this literally. Once the system of noble titles in Orlais was labyrinthine. There were barons and baronesses and baronets and sir barons and a horde of others, each with its own origins and its own nuances of comparison. The Orlesian aristocracy is ancient and much given to competition. All the nobility play the grand game, as it is known, whether they wish it or not. It is a game of reputation and patronage, where, movers, where moves are made with rumors, scandal, and when moves are made with rumors and scandal is the chief weapon. Huh. That sentence didn't make sense in my head. Anyway, no gentle game. This. More blood has been drawn as a result of the grand game than any war the Olesians have fought. Of this I am assured by almost every gentleman here. As far as titles went, everything changed with the coming of Emperor Draken, who established the Olesian Empire as it exists now and who created the Chantry. There is no more venerated figure in Orle. In Val Rior, the statue of Draken stands as tall as the statue of Andraste. I'm not sure if it's Draken or Draken. I think they've actually said Draken previously, I'm not sure, but... Anyway, uh, Draken determined that the Grand Game was tearing Ole apart, so he abolished all titles beside his own and Lord and Lady. I am told with some twittering amusement that this action did not end the Grand Game as Draken had intended. Now the Lords and Ladies collected unofficial titles rather than official ones, such as the Exalted Patron of Tassus Clay or Uncle to the Champion of Trems. It is a headache to remember such a title, and one vinces to think of the poor doormen at the balls who must rattle them off as each guest entered the room. The aristocracy is different from Ferelden in other ways as well. The Olesians' right to rule stems directly from the Maker. There exists neither the concept of rule by merit nor the slightest notion of rebellion. 
If one is not noble, one aspires to be. Or at least aspires to be in the good graces of a noble and is ever watching for a way to enter the patronage of those better placed in the grand game. And then there are the masks and the cosmetics. I have not seen so much paint since the kennels at High Ever, but that is another story. From Beyond the Frostbacks by Banteric of West Hill, 920 Dragon. That's fairly recent, isn't it? Well, as recent as it can be, all things considered. Mosaic peas, yay! You black wall? Remember how to carry your shields. You're not hiding, you're holding. Otherwise, it's useless. Blackwall? Warden Blackwall? You're not. How do you know my name? Who said. <laughs> ah! <Pfft>. What? <laughs> That's it. Help or get out. We're dealing with these idiots first. Conscripts, here they come. Oh, they don't look too happy. They look like our men. I don't like that. Sorry, bastards. Good work, conscripts. Even if this shouldn't have happened, they could have... Well, thieves are made, not born. Take back what they stole. Go back to your families. You saved yourselves. You're no farmer. Why do you know my name? Who are you? I know your name because I'm an agent of the Inquisition. I'm investigating whether the disappearance of Wardens has anything to do with the murder of the Divine. Maker's balls. The Wardens and the Divine. That can't... No, you're asking so you don't really know. <laughs> First off, I didn't know they disappeared. But we do that, right? No more blight, job done. Wardens are the first thing forgotten. But one thing I'll tell you, no Warden killed the Divine. Our purpose isn't political. Um... I wasn't accusing them. I'm not here to accuse. Not yet. I just need information. I've only found you. Where are the rest? I haven't seen any Wardens for months. I travel alone, recruiting. Not much interest because the Archdemon is a decade dead, and no need to conscript because there's no Blight coming. Treaties give Wardens the right to take what we need, who we need. These idiots forced this fight, so I conscripted their victims. They had to do what I said, so I told them to stand. Next time, they won't need me. Grey Wardens can inspire, make you better than you think you are. Why haven't you gone missing like the rest of them? Well, maybe I was going to. Or maybe there's a new directive, but a runner got lost or something. My job was to recruit on my own. Plan to stay that way for months. Years. <laughs> Do you have any idea where the other wardens could have gone? Maybe they returned to our stronghold at Weishaupt. That's in the Anderfels, a long way north. I don't really know. Can't imagine why they'd all disappear at once. Let alone where they disappear hmm. to. I wasn't aware Grey Wardens could take whatever they want. It's complicated. If there's a blight, everyone has to help the effort to fight it. The treaties are ancient. Outside of blights, it's as binding as a clever tongue <laughs> can make it. Well, thank you, Warden Blackwall. 
Now, where does this leave us? Inquisition. Agent, did you say? Hold a moment. The Divine is dead and the sky is torn. Events like these, thinking we're absent is almost as bad as thinking we're involved. If you're trying to put things right, maybe you need a warden. Maybe you need me. Yes, please. You're cool. Warden Blackwell, the Inquisition accepts your offer. Good to hear. We both need to know what's going on. And perhaps I've been keeping to myself for too long. This warden walks with the Inquisition. Sweet. Um. Let's see. We need a solace because we need a mate. Um. Who do we want though? I'm sorry, Varric. This sounds like too good a party to pass up. Plus, I like Cassandra. Yeah. Let's see, what kind of warrior are you? That's a two and then one. That's a one. That's a one. That's a one. I can actually choose. Oh. Hello. Um. Kind of. Talents do we have? Critical is weak. Jamal is in a stone like down. Oh, what? there's the war horn. Control. Strain. Oh, there's the war horn. <laughs> um. Two hundred weapon. Um, give me the edge to finish off. I feel he's more of a controller, I think. And we already have Cassandra that is basically sword and board. Um, check it out as slow. Be the weekend. There we go. Stand and knock down. That sounds good. It's hamstring people as well. You can now use common roll to recover from dis most disabling conditions. That's pretty sweet. Let's do this. I think I can buy things to re-roll if I feel that's not a good thing as well. Um, um, do I want sword and a board, and do or do I want the double thing of a bobber? Because that one's kind of cool. Dagger is no point. Um, let's try with the two-hander. Let's have you do some damage. While Cassandra do the tanking. Um... Let's go test this. Oh, there's something here, wasn't there? Ah, thought I saw something. More blood lotus, and this one over there as well. Oh, hello.
Well, that worked out. But that wasn't what I had in mind to try things, but it works. I was thinking going up the the ridge to the to the other place. I guess I'm on the wrong side of things. You know, I'm on the right side. I'm just further away than I thought. Up here is where I wanted to go. I wanted to see what this is. Carter Bowman. He died. Carta. Not from my clan, though. With both Templars and mages here, they profit greatly from smuggling Lyrian. Well. If they're smuggling Lyrium. Nug. If they're smuggling, oh, find the key to Valnamar. Right. Oh, up there. <laughs> eh. That was quite jumped up. So we need to find a key before we can get there. Now I'm out exploring again. <laughs> I was supposed to just go back there. <laughs> oh well. But I want to see where this leads. Where are you guys? We've been searching. Resources, commander's orders. No small task given recent troubles, but I've some supplies here you may find useful. Oh, cool. You're my guys. I like that. Maybe you should actually have some armor as well. I hear that might be useful. <laughs> well, not that I have a whole lot of armor, apparently. Um, What kind of accessories do I have? Don't have. Counter striking, we don't have. Stagger. Does more damage against those kind of things, I think. So, two extra tonics. Range defense. Oh. That's for Varric. I like that. And I think Cassandra should have the other one. Because I have one as well. And she's the one who supposedly takes damage. Every That one was hidden pretty well. Inside the ground. A letter found on a corpse. She told us right and proper, son. Three times around the crown statue. Right hand close enough to brush the stone itself. And the spirits will listen. Everything else has been done. We slipped the silver to the Chantry to save Grandfather's body from the burning, and he's buried close by. Three times around, always turning right, and the spirits will bring him back to us. Go now, and don't be afraid. Uh, eh. Ooh, logging stand. Yes. Perfect. Um, but yeah, that sounds like necromancy, and that won't be good, will it? Well, here's a long landmark. There we go. Oh, the, that's the third stanza. Ah, Saga of Tirda Brightaxe, our mother. 
Honey-tongued was Thelm of Tyrda, gifts of gold and steel to start. Wanted Tyrda's men for warriors, stolen tribe from stolen heart. Cold her tribe, the gold hand counseled, lean from winter's wind knife shill. Be my bride and cross the waking, eat the gilded sitter's fill. Tyrda Brightax, fraught with fury, crystal axe head stirred to blaze, heeded well her leaf ear lover, unabashed by lustful gaze. None shall break my tribe apart, not with demon words that kill. Fear my fury's fiery race, dream words lie, their thirsts unslaking. So... I don't remember if this was... Like three times or four times or something or something or something. I don't even know. <laughs> I'm not even sure if it was right way around or if it should be left left hand. Was it left? I don't know. You're in the way guys. Come on. Run with me. I don't know. Um I don't know. <laughs> what does the map say? Uh, three times, so we're running right hand close enough to brush the stone and the spirits will listen. 